everyone, thank you for tuning in to my vlog. I'm excited about today's vlog because I'm going to take you with me somewhere. And I know from past vlogs that you like it when I actually get out of the house and go somewhere safely in these Corona streets. You also like me to talk about my nails. And the last journeys that I took you on was uh, I went to a recently opened nail salon in my neighborhood and I took you along with me to kind of show you what that looked like at, during COVID times and the safety measures and precautions that they were taking. Well, uh, I got a few inboxes from you to tell me that there are, there is a black owned, a new black owned nail spa here in St. Louis. And you guys have been following me enough to know that I am all about supporting black business and trying to go out of my way to make sure that I support black owned businesses because we all we got I'm going to be going to one today I actually made an appointment it took two weeks to get into this place so it's very popular it's popping it's called Sonder Lush and yes it's black owned there is a black woman that owns it and she's a young woman too which is exciting I will be taking you with me while I go to Sonder Lush I'm just getting a basic gel manicure I used to wear overlay when corona happened and I had to soak them off and do all that stuff I said I don't want to have to go through that ever again and shall we get back into lockdown where everything is closed back down again I don't have to go through that process so I've just been wearing my nails no overlay with a gel manicure and uh, so that's what I'll be getting today is just a basic gel manicure and I cannot wait to see what it looks like and to take you along with me and to show you what Sonder Lush is all about. Again, I have been supporting black owned businesses. I found a black owned nail line online that I wanted to support too called Vendetta Nail Bar. They actually have a location in, in I believe Los Angeles and they also sell their own polish. I went online and purchased some nail color so I'll be bringing that with me because of course with COVID and with safety measures and stuff like that I want to use my own polish I don't want to be using polish that other people are using Vendetta gel and it's going to be a natural color if you could see it there um, I'm going for more of a natural nude color so that's the gel and then they also sent me the regular polish which is just a red which I'll be keeping in my collection as well so got the black owned nail polish and going to a black owned nail spa so I'm really excited let's go ahead and hop in the car and go to Sonder Lush Okay, so I have made it to Sonder Lush. It is actually located downtown St. Louis, so I'm in a parking lot where I've got to pay, so I'm getting ready to do that, and then I will walk there. I don't really see it from the street. I might have passed it, but I know it's on this next block. Probably just have to go pay for my parking. It is 11.15, so I'm 15 minutes early, so I might just walk around a little bit and take in some sights so you can kind of see what downtown St. Louis looks like or this is not really the epicenter of downtown this is like starting to get into it so you're not going to see the arch or anything from here but just give you a, a view of what downtown St. Louis uh, the beginnings of it looks like. So I just finished getting my nails done at Sonder Lush and they came out really well. I like the way that she did them and I will be coming back. I actually made another appointment. It's really important for us to support black owned businesses. Just the Washington district here in St. Louis. Kind of rainy, I feel a few raindrops. Mm 
Yes, I am very pleased with how my nails came out. Very, very pleased. Yeah, I'm excited.